Hello YouTubers, this is Anubafar, Invictus is upon us. There was a post with all the information that you need to understand it better. I have it linked in the description, but here's what you need to know. Invictus is an annual in-game event that celebrates the UEE Navy, provides a recruiting drive accompanied by a free fly where a new player can test all of what Star Citizen has to offer. And of course, we know it's also an opportunity to buy ships that are not normally available. Last year, the event, despite having some issues, was generally seen as a success and funding is another story altogether as it broke records. The main attractions are the fleet and the expo center at New Babbage on the planet Microtech. The center is built like a convention where you may visit daily themed rooms demonstrating current flyable ships and see holograms of future flyable ships. Between 21 May and 1 June, the theme shifts every 48 hours and it's critical to note that all you need to do is create an account to experience Star Citizen. You do not actually need to spend any money to enjoy it between the 22nd of May and the 3rd of June, where you can play for free. You're going to be provided an Avenger Titan as a loaner, plus you can rent ships at no charge. If you're new to Star Citizen, there's a code in my description which will get you 5,000 in-game credits just for using the code. Also, it's strongly recommended that you seek the help of a more seasoned Star Citizen veteran who may actually be able to show you the ropes. The game isn't a game yet, it's an alpha in development, so many of the regular help and manuals may not be what you're used to. To tour the preview of the Javelin, you're going to need to go to one of the main support ports in orbit of Hurston, Arcorp, or Microtech. There's a handy info panel at the landing zones to show you where the Javelin is currently docked. Renting ships is made easy by simply interacting with it while it's parked in the Expo Center, and this does not cost anything. To fly it though, you will need to request the ship at a terminal as if you'd purchased it. If you're a veteran of Star Citizen, you're going to expect limited ships to be sold in waves as before. They're going to be sold as follows. Wave 1, 4 p.m. UTC, which is 9 a.m. Pacific. Wave 2 is 12 a.m. UTC, which is 5 p.m. Pacific. And Wave 3 is 8 a.m. UTC, which is 1 a.m. Pacific. On the 21st of May, you'll be able to purchase the Connie Phoenix. On the 23rd is the Iterus P, plus the upgrade kit, plus the Javelin. On the 29th is the Kraken and Privateer plus their upgrade kits. And as a note, the Polaris will simply be sold this year unlimited. That's it for now. I'm going to break down more information in greater detail as I get it. Thank you very much for spending your time with me. I just wanted to mention that this month to celebrate Invictus, the Patreon backers are going to be giving away a Perseus with LTI, which is a $750 pledge. That will probably pop up on your feed in the next 24 hours if you're subscribed. This might be a great time to activate notifications and tell your friends about the channel. Fly safe and I'll see you in the verse.